this is my first time meeting Macy and we're gonna go over a few basic training techniques with her. She's 12 weeks old. Macy! Macy! Oh. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, uh, uh. And has lots of energy. Good. Uh, uh. Yes, good girl. So the first thing we're gonna focus on is just really getting her attention and getting her to know when she's sitting down. Macy! Yes! Good girl! And getting her introduced to the clicker word. Oh! Oh, is that too much? Oh, good girl! We got her to stop the jumping, so just knowing she's not going to get the treat when she jumps. We'll put that down. Macy! Yes, good girl. So I'm using the clicker word yes with Macy. Um, and so that is kind of instead of in a physical clicker, that is going to tell her that she's doing what I'm asking her to do. Macy! Yes! So the first thing you want to do with a puppy, a really young puppy, um, especially, is just Getting them to know their name really well. Macy! Oh. <gasps> Macy! <gasps> yes! Good girl! <laughs> so especially that one was really good when she came. Macy! Macy! <gasps> Macy! <gasps> yes! And I love to use the kissy sound. It's usually when you command a dog to do something, which we'll work on in a little while. Um, you only want to say the command one time. So a way that I start training right away is using that kissy sound. If she's not coming right away, oh, you sit. Kissy. So they're not going to sit all the time right away. So just be patient. <laughs> Excuse me, little missy. Yes, good girl. So the yes, the clicker word is always going to be accompanied by a treat in the beginning. And later on, you'll be able to use it with just a pet or anything to let them know that's the reward. Good girl, your ears are flopped over. What a good girl you are. Okay, so I'll let her be distracted. Macy! Yes! That one was so good! Good job! And one of the main things with their name, oh, you can, is to always associate their name with positivity. I know a lot of times it's really hard when, you know, they're getting into something and you're, or if they're not coming right away and you want to say their name sternly. But you always want you want them to love their name and know that when you're calling their name that it's always going to be positive when they come to you. Macy, I picked it up, silly. Good girl. So I'm going to wait and let her get distracted. Macy! on with Macy is sit and the most important thing with command training is to only say the command one time. So I'm going to get her up. Macy! <laughs> She's staying sitting. You want this? Macy! You want it? Good job! Sit! So I'm going to say the command and then do the hand gesture, which is this. And 
And even though she's not sitting right away, I'm not going to say it again. And so when I lose her attention, I'm just going to stick it. Yes! Good job! I'm just going to stick the treat right in front of her nose to get her attention back. And then when she does sit, she's staying. Um, make sure to say the command word. Macy! Macy! <gasps> Macy! <gasps> yes! Good girl! So we just lost her attention when another dog walked by over there. Um, so that was really awesome that she didn't go running. And she looked when I said her name. Just getting her to know that when I say her name, it's going to be a good thing and she's going to get a reward when she looks. Good girl. Macy! Yes! Good job! Macy! I'm going to bring her back around in front of me, so I'm just kind of luring her over to me. With the treat. Good girl. Sit. Yes. Good job. Macy. So cute. Macy. Yes. Good girl. So you want to just show her what when she's distracted, especially with the dogs going by, that what we have right here. Um, is better than what's over there. So I'm just constantly giving her pieces of treat. Macy! Yes! And rewarding her for not going over there. Sit. Macy. Macy, girl. Macy! Yes! Good girl. Once you have them in the seated position, you say the command. Macy, lay down. And I'm just gonna lure her down. Yes! Good job! And she's really quick with learning this. Not every dog will be this fast. It took my puppy about four sessions before he actually even laid down. So once they do exhibit the command that you're get, trying to get them to do. You want to tell them their clicker word, so I use yes. Um, and I use that instead of a physical clicker, just because it's using the same concept as using a regular clicker, but you're not going to always have that clicker on you, and your voice is something that you always have on you. Excuse me. <laughs> Sit down. Yes, good girl. So it's really important to make sure you don't give them the treat when they're jumping up or anything like that. You want them to know as soon as they sit and calm down, that's when they're gonna be rewarded, especially for little puppies. So we'll do lay down one more time. Ready? So now I'm gonna, um, since she is following my hand really well with the lay down, I'm going to give her the lay down signal, which is this, Macy! Yes, girl. You ready? Macy, lay down. So she doesn't obviously know that yet. This is her third time ever doing it. So I'm going to do that and then lure her down. Yes! Good girl! Good job! Macy! Yes! Good girl! I 
hope you enjoyed my mini training session with Macy today. For a complete, comprehensive guide on how to train your puppy, including 13 step-by-step -step training command tutorials with over 200 pages of information on how to raise and train your puppy, check out the Puppy Training Handbook at All Things Pups. Don't forget to follow at Macy the Golden Pup on Instagram.